Welcome to the AV42C GPS Guided Bombs tutorial. In this video, we will cover how to utilize the GBU38 and the GBU39 guided bombs. The GBU38 is a 500 pound GPS guided direct attack bomb. It's basically a Mark 82 with a guidance package strapped on, and these can be mounted on any of the wing pylons as a single bomb a pair, or a set of three. The GBU-39 is a GPS-guided, small diameter bomb that has built-in folding wings, allowing it to glide long distances and hit targets with extreme precision. When mounting the GBU-39 on any wing pylon, it will come in a set of three bombs, or they can be mounted to the belly of the airframe as a set of four. Both of these bombs are operated in a similar fashion. However, due to the built-in folding wings, the GBU-39 can be released much farther out from the target. First, use the targeting pod to mark targets via the GPS Send feature. It may help to have the GPS screen open on another MFCD so we can verify that each target is marked. Once all targets are in the GPS system, make sure the master arm switch is in the on position. We will notice that the HUD now has two circles. On the outer circle, there is a small arrow that directs us to the first marked target. Place that arrow at the very top of the HUD. In doing so, we know that we are flying directly towards the target. For multiple targets, it is better to have the target mode set to auto, and I will explain why momentarily. With the targets inside the inner circle, simply squeeze the trigger until one bomb for each target has been dropped. In this case, that would be five bombs. Once the ordinance has been deployed, it is recommended to change course so we don't inadvertently fly over any hostile SAM sites. But for this demonstration, we will watch the fireworks show. The outer circle on the HUD shows the bomb's range, and any targets within the inner circle will be hit with greater accuracy. Underneath the circles, we can see the calculated release, listed simply as CR. The calculated release shows us the distance between the target and our aircraft when the target is at the dead center of the inner ring on the HUD. There are several configurable settings within the equipment menu. With target mode set to auto, when a bomb is released, the next GPS target will automatically be selected. When target mode is set to manual, we must manually select the next target on the GPS screen. Setting target mode to dumb, the GPS guided bomb will lose several IQ points and no longer guide itself towards GPS targets, just like a standard unguided bomb. The auto release rate acts just like the ripple rate for unguided bombs. At 120, holding the trigger will release bombs at a rate of 120 bombs per minute, or 2 bombs per second. Combining a high release rate with the target mode set to auto can be absolutely devastating to hostile ground units. This concludes the AV-42C GPS Guided Bomb Tutorial.